Hey, hey, hey! Welcome to Jason is a Social Scientist. By mouth daily, pill number 743. So, some of you might be wondering what the show is about. People often wonder what the show is about. The premise is deceptively simple. I take my HIV medication live on the book of face each day in front of friends, family, and strangers. I do so in order to embrace stigma, dispel ignorance, and find support. After 743 pills, 743 shows, a number of bells, whistles, and bows have risen up and around and about the show. The bells, bows, and other people, the people that come back night after night and give me the most valuable resource, their time. To me, that's the most significant thing that's risen up and around and about the show. The <laughs> The community. Therein lies the support that I was looking for. But a number of bells, whistles, and bows have risen up and around and about the show. Ding dong bell. Boy to see now. Hell, I mean, heck. This show has it all. I like to say that it is Cloud Atlas and that it incorporates at least 600 years of entertainment with Edward R. Murrow's radio broadcasts on record and cylinders played on a 19th century Edison home phonograph along with a nursery rhyme book from my childhood containing woodcut illustrations from the 15th century. It is, in a sense, also The Matrix. In a previous iteration of the show, I created something I call the Rainbow Tunnel, in which I harnessed the power of Grayskull and the Eye of Thundera, funneling them through a series of warp nacelles, creating a static warp bubble at a subsequent singularity, punching a hole through the fourth wall, across the multiverse, and into the source. The show now takes place in an echo chamber created by me that serves as a way station between our reality and the source. I don't expect lay people to fully understand as this is advanced social science. Yeah, so the show is also like an old timey variety show, Carol Brunette style, mixed with a merry melody of Looney Tunes and a measure of Mark and Mindy, a dash of Mr. Ed, and two two doses of Alice in Wonderland, a helping of Hee Haw, heaps of Benny Hill, a hint of the Highlander. Tons of the Twilight Zone, a tincture of Teen Wolf, oh, 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 an ounce of Oz, a cup of Creep Show and Cast Away, a quart of Quantum Leap, and a gallon of Gilligan's Island. It's a four hour show and a four hour, four minute tour. Piles of Pee Wee's Playhouse, a pinch of Peter Pan, a pound of Papa, I, I am what I am, a whole block of Mr. Rogers' Neighborhood, and a ration of the Rocky Horror Picture Show. I'm just a sweet. Transvestite, transsexual, Transylvania, ha ha, come up to the lab, see what's on the slab, I can see you shiver with Antissa. Patient. T -t -t touch me, I want to be dirty, uh, thrill me, chill me, full, fill me, creature of the night, an undone Benjamin Button, a corny ear of Dumbo, a college try of I spy, a couple raw strokes of Bob Ross, a spoonful of Mary Poppins, and the full Monty Python, finally... Lumpin' Rick and Morty with a leader, a leader, a leader. If I love Lucy in the sky with diamonds and wham, bam. Thank you, ma'am. You've got the show. Everything is out of place and out of time here, including and especially me. Alice will always be pregnant. Harambe will always be ready for her high fives. The first and the second coming will always be risen with the Obamas getting blowjobs from the Woodies. The Superman and their boners will always be spinsters and sempstresses working in the sweatshop. The twin, twin towers will always stand with Lady Liberty. You will have their MTV. Pigs will fly. Disco and dance will rain like men did in the days of old. I write nightly the future history of anachronism for your future children and your elderly grandparents. May they enjoy it now and time. Immemorial. If I'd have people take only one thing away from this show, it would be the knowledge that HIV is preventable. If you're HIV negative, there's a once a day pill you can take. They call it PrEP, pre-exposure protocol. The pill is Truvada, and if you're HIV negative, you take it once a day, and it works like a highly effective chemical condom. It prevents HIV. But if you're already HIV positive like me, treatment is prevention. 
By taking my medication every day and maintaining an undetectable viral load, it makes it so I'm not contagious. U equals U. Undetectable equals untransmissible. You could fuck me bareback all day long and <laughs> never catch HIV for me. It's a brave new world. The future is now. And it's 1969. Free love. Woo! All right. Pill number 743. Down the hatch. James, people will judge you whether you say anything or not. <laughs> People will judge you regardless. All right, so pill number 743, down the hatch. We are robot. Ah, 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 ah. All right, all right. <laughs> I don't know. Uh, a while back, I, you know, I, you know, I, you know, I'm uh, as raised Catholic. You know, I'm good. There's a Catholic little Catholic boy that lives inside of me. Uh, and you know, I've you know I've always you know guilt and shame just is like <laughs> it just uh, it's uh, infused in your DNA as a Catholic. And so um, at some point I realized you know like I I I feel guilt and shame anyway. I might as well fucking you know if I'm gonna feel it from now on I'm gonna fucking sure as fucking earn it. <laughs> All right, dig it to heck. Oh, I hurt my back. I was roughhousing with the boys. They had a friend over, and we were playing cops and robbers. And I was like, I had, uh, I was holding my son's arms so the other kid could handcuff him. And I don't know, just something went <laughs> with my back. That was no fun. Oh, it's all right, D Ray. I just uh, well, last night I had a short show too. I have just been in a funk. I've been in a big old funk. I just can't shake it. I don't know. I don't know. Just like I don't know what I'm doing, but that's all right. I'm gonna I'm gonna survive. I'm gonna keep plugging away. <laughs> you at least get this much of a show out of me every every night. Still, you'll see. At least get to see the pill go down the hatch. <laughs> no, I thought so. Drayton. All right, all right. I love you all. Oh. That's part of the conflict, Daniel. I don't know. I don't know. I don't really... Like, anyway, but well, let's focus on positive things. Like, yeah, Thanksgiving, I think, uh, my wife told me that we're going to my niece's house for a Thanksgiving dinner. That should be fun. <laughs> all right, all right. I know. I know I'm not the only one. Facebook jail. Hey, I love you too, Daryl. I love you all. Rita. Oh, thank you all for being here. Kat, I love you too. Uh, you too, James. Mary Turkey. Hey, all right. <laughs> the same to you. I love you all. Um, I'll probably check in. Um, maybe do a little Thanksgiving show. Now that I know I'm going to be at, uh, uh, at my niece's house. All right, I love you all. Love you too, William Moss, man. Oh, I love you all. Mm -hmm. Good night.